To begin the assembly of your pump and motor, place the motor into a firm base and let the lead hang to the side. Now, using a screwdriver or nut driver, remove the screen from the pump end. Then, remove the cable guard. Before placing the pump end onto the motor, locate the lead slot. Then slide the pump end onto the four motor studs, aligning the slot with the lead. If the coupling does not easily slide onto the motor splines, remove the pump and slightly rotate the pump coupling. Then try to reassemble. Now place and hand tighten the four motor nuts. Then finish tightening them with an open box end wrench, using a crisscross pattern to prevent misalignment. Once tightened, lay the pump and motor assembly on its side with the lead facing up. Next, lay the lead wires flat going up the pump end and place the cable guard over the leads. Now fasten the cable guard with the screws. Stand the entire assembly upright and carefully wrap the screen around the pump bracket and fasten with the original screws. If you need further assistance with your pump motor assembly, call Franklin Electric's Technical Service Hotline. Technical support is also available online at franklinelectric.com.